Okay, good morning everyone. Alright, now today we are going to start the 3B book. Okay, Shaping Maths 3B book. Alright, course book. Now, I hope all of you have collected back your books today. Have already collected back your books. Alright, so today we are going to start with the course book 3B. Alright, now we are going to start the new topic which is measures. Okay, measures are going to be of different. How do we measure things? Some we measure, like measure the table, uh, measure the cupboard, measure a person in height, measure the distance, the weight, the volume. So we are going to learn about the different kinds of measures. Okay, now first we are going to start with length. Length means how long, all right? How big, how long? That's what we are going to start with. So, uh, course book 3B, all right, page 2, that is the first chapter which is called Measures. Now, you can look at the picture. Our baguette is longer than 1M. Now, 1M means 1 meter. Now, you have seen this uh, ruler in the classroom. Now, this ruler is 1 meter long. This is the length of this ruler, one meter, okay? So, one meter, the baguette is lo longer than one meter. So, you can look at, the baguette is the bread, okay? Can we break the world record? Then, how much flour do I need? Now, how much flour do I need is the weight. So, we are going to do the length, the weight, and also, I need one liter of milk. How many cartons of milk may I use? Must I use? So again, one liter is the volume. So we are measuring liquids. We are measure, measuring solids. Solids like uh, um, flour, okay, or weight of a person. And we are measuring the length, all right? So in this particular topic, we are doing all three, all right? Okay, but first we are going to start with length. Okay, so turn the page, page 4. Length in meters and centimeters. Now, if you all have a ruler, take your rulers and you can see that you have, take your rulers, you can see that you have in your ruler centimeters. Some rulers will have inches or millimeters or some some rulers will have centimeters okay so most of the rulers have centimeters and inches okay so we are going to be doing centimeters all right so this is a centimeter cube so you can look at the picture the length of its side is 1 cm now centimeter the short form of writing centimeter is cm all right now, 1 meter is equal to 100 cm. So, this 1 meter ruler is equal to 100 cm. If you, when you come to school, I will show you there is 100 cm in this ruler, okay? Now, the walking stick is as long as a meter ruler. Its length is 100 cm. Arrange 5 desks together to form a long table. And then you measure it. Okay, now if you guys were in school, we would have done this. But since we're not there, we're going to just move on to the next page. Now, before I do this, I want you to write the day and date in your exercise book. Alright? Then, write the topic, measures. Please write it on the first slide. Then, write down... Length in meters and centimeters. Please see that your spellings are correct. All right. Please check your spellings. All right. Underline the title in blue. Okay, now leave two lines and leave three boxes from the margin. 
and right down. One, or rather you can draw a box, okay? Take, leave two lines and leave three boxes from the margin. And draw a box of ten. Ten and one down. Okay? Ten across and one down. And inside you write down one cm is equal to, sorry, one m is equal to hundred cm. Now please write this one number in one box, okay? So, draw a box of 10 across and one down and inside the box right down, 1m is equal to 100cm. So, you must remember this conversion, okay? Alright, then leave a line and draw a line. Okay. Then write down one A. You can write down one A. Now the one A is the children took different types of transport to get to their things. To get their things to the festival hall. Kaylee took a taxi. So the length of my taxi is 4M. So I, what I want you to do is write down. Kaylee took a taxi. Alright, then I want you to draw the taxi, okay? Draw it. So you draw the taxi and cover it, okay? And then this length is 4M. So you draw the arrow and write down here 4M. Alright? It's there in the book. It is there in the book. So look at the book and draw the picture, okay? Now, of course, when you draw the taxi, don't draw it so big, alright? So, what is the length of the taxi? Leave a line and then write. Is 4M. That means 4 meters. The length of the taxi is 4 meters. So, 1 meter is 100 cm. So, 4 meters will be 400 cm. Okay? 1 meter is 100 cm. So, 4 meters will be 400 cm. 